Trucks Gone Wild is here for the very first time. It's packed, there's trucks all over the place, and this is the Trucks Gone Wild family. We're like the Honey Badger. We don't give a damn. First time here in Dallas, Georgia, right? What am I gonna see out here this weekend? You're gonna see a very fun time, action like you've never seen before. Yeah? Florida has a lot to offer, but I think right here in Dallas, we got a whole lot more to offer. All right, man, I'm bad with first names. What's your name again? They call me Bobby by God White. Why is that? I don't give a f about nothing. I heard you're the guy to see if I need anything, pretty much I got anything. Call, whatever you need. Yeah. Whatever you need. What are you doing out here, man? I haven't been to uh, Dallas, Georgia before, so uh, you're the guy I need to see. Yeah, Dallas, Georgia's where it's at, man. You see all these good-looking women we got walking around. I have seen a few of them. We got mud trucks. We got cold bear. Is Elvis your real name? <laughs> Elvis is my real name. Bobby By God White is the man to see if you're in Dallas, Georgia, That's and you need right. anything. Yeah, right up off 61. Come on with it. How do I get a hold of you? Six seven eight four nine two. <laughs> dirty days on dirt cheap. Can you teach me how to do that? That that hip. How to, how does that go? Kind of. I'm going a little fast, aren't I? You gotta go with the flow. That's right. Do the surfboard. Going good back here? Yes. Yeah, you checking it out? Yes. Nothing's broken. That's everything's cool. Alright. Alright. I think it's I think it's good. I think it's good. No, oh, Devious Derek, dude. What's happening? Hey man, what's going on, bro? Pretty good, pretty good. good. Felicia Jackson, will you marry me? Yes. Oh look at <laughs> this! <laughs> Dallas, Georgia, there is romance in the air. And she said yes. Congratulations, kids. That is awesome. Oh my oh my god. Oh, I always cry. But I didn't say yes. So he got to talk to me first. Oh, wait, hold on. There's a turd in the punch bowl. Hold on. Dad, Dad said he's got to approve. Dad? 
Well, Do you approve? Yeah, I'll approve of it in one condition. What's that? I better not get no phone call that he mistreated her. <laughs> no, sir. No, sir. Fair enough. Fair enough. Don't you think that's fair enough? I think it's fair enough. Hey. I think my man's going to treat her good. That's what I'm talking about. Buddy Mike, I'm going to tell you, Devious Derek going to treat her right. And I'm going to endorse this proposal and let y'all know I need an assistant pimp. So applications will be accepted. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Alden County, Georgia. Matt Smith, big Alden air winner, County. brother. What is going on out here this afternoon? Hammer time got a screw blower. I ain't even Hammer finished time yet. Hammer time is but, every time. Hey, if it wasn't for the 48 people come by the shop and help me get the transmission back in, Uncle Mikey back there, he do me some intake gaskets, and hell, I still come out here and tore it up, but you know what? It was a good time, so it, it was all worth the camera show, and all these little ones right here, they put it on. They make me scream, make me act like a dumbass, so you know what? <laughs> It's all for y'all kids. We got the kids everywhere, dude. We got the people on the hill. Everybody's cheering. That's how Paul and County is, you know. So if y'all want to come hate, once you build you one and come run one, you know what I'm saying? Paul and County, Georgia, baby. <laughs> Woo!
So we're at this place called Wheeling in the Country. It's in Summertown, Tennessee, and Trucks Gone Wild has never been to Tennessee, and everything's different, right? Terrain's different, trucks are different. I don't know anybody here, so. Hi, Matt. Need a cold beer? I do. Thank you very much. I was a little bit nervous, but I'll tell you what, this place is going to work out just fine. We talk all day about how crazy the drivers are out here, but there's more crazy people, and that's the women that ride with them. Ashley, do you actually like this? Are you being supportive? I mean, what's the deal? Oh, yeah, I love it. Um, most time, I don't really have a choice to ride with them, but I definitely enjoy it. It's one heck of a ride. Cameron, the man of got to be a gabillion hits on YouTube, man, checking it out. Great to have you out here. And the bottom line is this, man. A lot of guys just want to go up the obstacle, up and down. Yep. You like to cut donuts on the way up and down. Yeah. What's up with that? You know, a lot, a lot of the people, um, they like they like to see crazy stuff happen. And I like to do whatever it does to make people smile, cheer, and yell. <laughs> you know, you, usually if I get a crowd going, it, is, it makes me want to gas it that much more. You know, you hear guys say in the mud world, man, like, the rock rolling's boring and stuff. Ain't nothing oh, yeah. boring what was going no, on no, out here today, no. man. Nothing. In my opinion, uh, mud is fun too, but it's straight line in a way. Right. You know, like straight line mud drag race and stuff like that. I've seen seen a bunch of. Yeah, we don't do that either. Though. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? uh, if I, I want to do something that's full throttle and uh, takes a little bit back to the brain to save rollover if you're going to turn over. Right. And um. Gonna turn and jump exactly. and have some fun. Exactly. Turn sideways. Most people freeze and hold the brake. I want to be the one who uh, reach up on the side of the wheel, side of the wheel, gas it, be able to drive by the roller. It's all about showing off, isn't it? Yeah, it, uh, that, that's that's a lot of it too. And, uh, hey, I'm Timmy Cameron. And this is why I got 20 billion YouTube hits.
Just like the NFL, NASCAR, and everything else on TV, it's time for Trucks Gone Wild to get a female sideline reporter. I think you're going to do a great job out here today. This is Crystal Marie. She's the Trucks Gone Wild Hottie of the Month for March 2012. Crystal, congratulations. Thank you very much. Happy to be here. You know, you got about a half a billion friends on Facebook, which is very impressive. That's cool, but are you up for the task out here today? I mean, this is a tough job. Yes, I am. Really? You think you can handle this kind of work? Handle it. I'll do it better than you. No, no, no. What could you possibly bring to the table that I already don't bring? Well, let's see. I'm going to go find some mud, yeah. some big trucks, and some hot guys. Oh. Yes, but first, I'm going to need this. Truck's running good, just getting a little dirty. Getting a little dirty, the mud's all nice and wet. Yeah. So, Matt told me a lot about you. He said people from South Cadillac, you don't do hugs. Well, that's coming from Matt, and I don't hug guys. Oh, you don't hug guys, so I get a nice Oh, hug. yeah, oh, yeah. Hey, Chuck D, what's up? Hello, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm good, who are you? Uh, um, this is my new co-host, Katie Janine. Hello. I like this. This is good. This is good. Um, you know, I, I really don't need to know where Matt's at right now. It's all well, good. Well, we're taking over. That's it. Trucks Gone Wild. New host, co-host. You know, this Pudding could work. Creek. This could work. I like it because you have way better hair than Matt well, Steele. you know, I work hard on that. And the legs are way better than Matt oh. Steele's. You know, and, a and, little mud. And good voice, too. I like that. <laughs> and this is just great. Matt, bye-bye. can't help you in the hot dude department. <laughs>
Jimmy, uh, Jimmy ran better than normal. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, wait, we gotta get Jimmy. Oh, wait, hang on here. Jimmy, don't forget the bank Thanks to uh, Stealth Clothing, Big Shocks, uh, Ford, uh, it's a Chevy, Toyota, um, military axles, trucks by Trotter, <laughs> Sunoco Racing Fuels, of course, they supplied us the fuel to get here. So I came from the cloud to Perry this morning and we ran good. Jimmy did good. Grab my trophy. Whoa! All right! Jimmy Riggin! That's a prize right there.
different states out here, of course. We've got Missouri, Tennessee, the Carolinas, Florida, Georgia. Where are you guys from? Mississippi. Mississippi. That's the first one out here today. Y'all having a good time? Yes, sir. Yeah, how do you spell that? <laughs> M I these events it's america we're out in the country there's engines everywhere it's holy crap who in the world are you america yeah nice suit man can you drink through that thing hell yeah i can who's your trusty sidekick right here this hot america girl hot america girl what's happening it obviously doesn't get more american than this right now it doesn't and what do we have to say to people who don't like america you know what i'll show you unzip me babe america, america. yeah, yeah. Boom! Truck's gone wild, coming at you from Bricks Off Road Park. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready to kick off the slew? Brother, the crowd was going crazy, and I do believe, unofficially as it might be, I think you just went the furthest anybody's ever gone in the slew. That's what they're saying. Yeah. And they stopped you, right? Yeah, they stopped me, wouldn't let me run out. Nice, you could have kept on going. That's cool. Yeah. Good combination, right? Yeah, it works good. Actually, it's first run with the tires. Right. I've actually run 44s on it till today. I mean, this is the first time I've even had it in love with those tires. On it. What are you thinking in the future now? You liking these tires? I think I'm gonna leave it the way it is. <laughs> okay, cool. Congratulations, brother. Nice job. Party on, baby, it's happy hour! Yeah! He won the truck and drove three hours, man. We called him a little while ago, dude. Congratulations, Freddie. You got the keys, right? The keys right here. That's awesome, Here's my boy. Mitchell, congratulations, brother. That's yeah. awesome, dude. It's unbelievable. I kid you not. <laughs> this is the first time. We've been doing this for a long time. This is the first time anybody's won a mud truck, dude. How cool is that? Man, it's unbelievable. But you know what? You know what the sad thing is? I'm not keeping it because <laughs> I want my wife to have it. She needs it. She needs a toy. Hey. I think 
The, the couple that muds together stays together. That's right. We see a lot of like homegrown TGW stuff. It's awesome, but this is a first. Yeah. Look at this. TGW carved into the dog, baby. That's why we love Bricks Off Road Park. It's the guy wanting you to move. Oh man, forget him. Forget him, dude. Seriously, I think you might want to move. Oh man, I'll be all right. All right, whatever, dude. I mean, it's cool, dude. Ryan, I'm trying to get people to move. I'm trying to get things situated, brother. It's terrible. Everybody's in the damn way. If they don't get out of the way, I'm gonna run over them. Dude, it's packed out here, man. I don't even know what to do. I don't know. I tell you what, I'll show you what I'm gonna do. I'm working, brother. I'm working. Solves the parking problem. That's how I roll, bitches. Stay out of my way. We go back about 15 years, and there's people out here this weekend saying you go both ways, man. What's the deal with that? Well, Matt, you know, I like to experiment. Woo, all this activity. I am starving. I have got to get something to eat. I think this is the spot. Whoa. Hey, he looks happy. Look at that. The party's in his mouth, and everybody's, well, you know. acres is awesome to party on unless of course you're lost and you're out of beer and you're starving and you're about out of gas whoa hey the good news is at least somebody left me a hamburger uh, dude, I think that's, uh... this is man versus wild at this point dude it's all about survival now
how we get out of Coast Gone Wild, we get paid up. If you and I, let's hey. just, make, we'll just go make it rain. Ooh, make it rain, baby, make it rain. <laughs> This is how we do it, bitches, South Georgia style. Truck's gone wild. You better get it. What's your name? Uh, Jade. Jade, of course it is. Now, Jade, is it safe to say that you are Asian? Uh, good call. Thank man. you, thank you. I'm pretty good. Now, I thought, though, that the Asians really preferred the little tuner cars and the, those things, not necessarily the big mud trucks. It doesn't mean that I eat rice. I don't like mad. Uh, see, that's a good point, though. I'm learning a lot out here at these events. That's the idea, right? That's how we grow, bitches. <laughs> Hammer time. I got another win here at Trucks Gone Wild and Whore Tents. Dude, I own this place. <laughs> it's another Trucks Gone Wild event and another win for the Hammerhead. Thank you guys. Super rebel. It's always good to come out to these events and know that I am safe and that somebody's watching my back, but I'm not exactly familiar with this particular superhero. Sir, what is your name? I am Super Rebel! Super oh! Rebel! Where is it that you get all of this strength? Right here, my good friend. Oh, that makes perfect sense. Ooh. Super Rebel. Ah, my mind is at ease. Easy. Ooh. Woo! Easy, Seabiscuit. It's That's all right. good. I'm like Mini Rebel. <laughs> you are Mini Rebel. <laughs> you could be my Mini Rebel. <laughs> Four tens, we close the way cross. We're two hours from Dublin, Georgia, and we raise in hell.
Everybody's calling me from all over the world. They're saying, Matt Steele, what's up? I'll tell you what's up. We're at the Three Fires Off Road Park in Bark River, Michigan. I'm talking about the Upper Peninsula, the UP. We got the Upers, baby. We got the Minnesota Invasion, the Cheeseheads from Wisconsin, the Phipps from Illinois. Everybody's here to be a part of the action. That's the deal. And here's what's going on. We're talking about big trucks. We're talking about hot chicks and nonstop 4x4 action and the pro wrestling revolution. Not to mention, we got this jabroni right here. Take a look at this. Come here. Oh. That's what's up. second time ever, and the second state ever, we see right here, the Flabongo. It makes its triumphant return. Take a look at this. Flabongo. talking out here this weekend and they said you have the best outfit out here man congratulations well I mean when you look this good I mean you got to share it with the world don't you babe I mean look at that look at that out here for the first time ever. Like professional haircuts at the mud hole. Look at this, the line's like a mile long. I don't know if it's for the haircuts or what. I don't know what the deal is. But here, look at this. Zip ties in the shirt, right? So this happened because you had to rip the sleeves off, right, in a portalette incident? Yep, no toilet paper in the body, porta bodies, none of it. Sometimes you gotta make do. You gotta make do? You're like MacGyver, my friend. That's who you are, that's awesome. Look at this, now, now look at this. Now these, uh, and a tongue tattoo. a lot of things here this weekend that we've never seen before but I mean it hasn't been that crazy it's not like we saw a werewolf dancing on a stripper pole with a bunch of chicks in a party bus or anything this pretty much happens all the time really
studying the angles and the approach is Chad Kornovich and the American Dream Dusty Ramaker. Some people think this isn't serious. These guys studying the angles, the jump. Is everything going to be perfect? Only time will tell. It's a perfect day out here at Twitty's Mud Bog, and you take a look at this. We've got the best of the best from the Carolinas. They're here. We've got No Sweat Steamboat, No Belicious out of Florida. They're here. Three trucks representing the Nasty Boys off-road out of Georgia. It's like an all-star reunion in South Carolina going on right here. We've even got Bam Bam out here working the show, man. Is everything under control? Well, hell no. Absolutely perfect. We wouldn't have it any other way. Have a nice day. <laughs> Get the crowd going. There you go. Yeah. Uh, uh. Let's go get Daisy. I know she's my cousin, but she's hot. Hold on now. Look, at, it's happy hour in the stands, and I've got to go inspect the cooler real quick. So, hold on one second. That'll do just fine. That'll do just fine. You know, that's what I'm talking about. Here, but, so I can't help but looking at it. That's a nice ride right there. What year is that? A 1985. 1985. Looks like you guys have done some work to it, right? Yeah, we've put a lot of money invested in it. A lot of time, a lot of money. Yep. You take it to a lot of shows? Yeah, we try to go all over. That's very cool. I, I don't usually do this, but y'all mind if I take a little spin in there? No, go ahead. That's cool. I'll be easy on it. Okay. Don't worry about it. I'm, okay. I'm safe. I'm a good guy. Thank you. Wow! This is amazing! That's amazing! Who knew? 
This truck belongs to my buddy Mitchell. Now, Mitchell's been to almost as many Trucks Gone Wild shows as I have. That's a bunch of them. But you never see the truck on the videos, and I'll tell you why. It doesn't crash, and it never breaks. This thing is built too good. You know, people ask me all the time, Matt, why don't you build a truck and bring it out for the events? I wish I had that kind of time, but if I did, this is the way I'd go. Okay, so everything's going smooth. The show's on a little break, and I can't shake this thing out of my mind. I don't know why I can't stop thinking about it, but we're not teaching our kids right. They're missing something in the school system, and there's some values that they're not being taught, and I have to do something about it right now. Now, guys, listen to me. This is very important. You guys are the future of this country and Trucks Gone Wild, all right? So it's important that you know a few things, and you're not going to learn this in school. This is only the kind of stuff that Matt Steele teaches you. You ready? There's three things you need to remember when you go through life. The first thing is don't sweat the small stuff, all right? Pretty much everything is small stuff. Number two, now this is very important. If somebody comes up to you and they say, hey, there's plenty of business for everybody, or there's more than enough to go around, all they're trying to do is cut in on your action. Number three, the most most important one that you can ever remember your whole entire life no matter how hot she is there's somebody out there that's tired of her all right just remember those three things and you guys are gonna do just fine Thanks, Matt. no problem guys I love you kids man it feels good to give back This is what happens when North Carolina comes to South Carolina. Boom, boom. So 20 man, another good show. Congratulations, this was awesome. And uh, but the bad news is, from what I'm hearing, that's it for this track, right? Yeah, this is the last time we'll be here. Uh, the mud hole's been here probably 25, 26 years, and I, the word is they sold it. And I'm good till April, and then when they go put baseball fields on it, we're gonna pour a little out for the homies. Look at that. Boom, what, boom. What? We're not dying. Right. We're just moving. So you're still going to be playing? Yeah. So we can still come back to South Carolina? you damn right. Just somewhere else? Right. All right. Just call me and let me know where it is and we'll be there. I'll do it. I quit wasting beer. Exactly. Twenty, that's great news. Dude, I feel a lot better now. All right. <laughs> now we can pour some in my throat for the homie. Right. Cool. Give me one. Give me one. Mm. I'm with you. Can somebody tell me what's going down out here this weekend?
sweat the third annual King of the Sling race going on out here today. You've won the first excuse, two. What? Excuse me. What? Um, I'm going to be the third time King Sling champion oh, after today. I'm sorry, dude. You can I'm call so, me bad. King Sling. It's okay. King. I apologize. That's a lot better. You know what I mean? Uh, no shortage of confidence going into this one. No, for sure. No, definitely not. Um, we got this hands down. Got it in the bag? Oh yeah. Easy. Hi, brother. So you guys are flowers going wild, and we're trucks going wild. That makes us almost family, right, Courtney? Yeah, pretty much like second cousin. Yeah, that's better than siblings. You know what I mean? Just better. a little bit less explaining to you. I've been talking to a lot of people, Carly, and they're telling me that you said you want to be on the cover of the next video. Is that true? That's true. Now, what should we use for a cover shot? Because I don't have that great of an imagination. So do you have any suggestions? Well, it's up to you guys. Either you can use my face, my body, my butt, well, let's take a look and see. You guys decide, all right? So your face, right? Carly, nice. All right, body. Interview. Hand of the butt. All right, America, you make the call. Sweat, you did it again. 2010, 11, and 12, King of the Sling, man. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Yeah, we got out here with the new truck this time, and you know, there was a lot more stiff competition out here. Like, we got OP and Hammerhead and Steamboat and yep, all these yep. guys, they got the big motors and all that. And uh, it came out, you know, the other driver's course, like always, and came out on top again. So, what, what do you think, man? Do we need to retire this event and just quit doing it all together? That way, you just remain undefeated for the rest of your life. No, I think um, everybody else just needs to step their game up and, you know, beat me, I mean, really, I mean, we've been driving it pretty good, and we got a newer truck here, and it's only going to get better, so. It's all you got to do. Come on out and beat this guy, and you could be king of the sling.
Temporary tattoos. I'm all out of those. Chuck took my last one. Wait. See, it's clean right there. See that? That's clean, isn't it? Come on. Uh, Come on. Get it in there. Get it in there. That's little, a 20. A little higher. That's a 20. Oh. I expect oh. something for this. Oh, okay. A little higher. A right. little higher. That's good. <laughs> I'm, I'm, all right. I got something on my finger. You know, what did that one? What? Eddie, we go back about 15 years, and out here today, a lot of people are saying you go both ways, man. What's up with that? Uh, yeah, you got to go both ways. It's a blast. <laughs> Action. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Cancel. That was perfect. The weather is perfect here at Twitty's Mud Bog in South Carolina. You know you've got... Ah, sorry. Weather is perfect at Twitty's Mud Bog right here, man. Everything is going great. Ah, sh sorry, sorry. I still didn't. I, something. <laughs> Look at this up here. It says capacity 10 people. 10 people. How are they going to fit in here? I mean, I can see seven or eight people in here, but not 10. All right. Like, like last time, I was a little. Intoxicated last time, but this time we go get intoxicated. I'm ready for that, dude. I'm ready. And there's moonshine. I got a sample, right? Uh, allegedly. I can't say it out loud. Allegedly. I just have to show you. Fair enough. You know, you can't come up to a pimp without a gift or offering of some type of about, something. You know? All right. All right. I got. Uh, how about that? That's Man, fresh. Dude. That's sealed. It's clean. Look at this. Look at this. See, I'll, I'll get rid of. It. Thanks, bro. Look at that. Pow. Could you even pop oh, the top? Look at that. I can do that for a pimp. Can I do that for a pimp? You want me to test it? Make sure it's okay? Nah, 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 because it's sealed. You know what I'm saying? All we right. don't play them games. All right. Hey, bodyguard. Hey, what you doing, dog? Whoa, 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 we don't tell this, man. Hey, you gotta, he, he, he getting close to that mic. You got to pay attention to a pimp. Whoa, all right, all right. Dude, it's good, it's good. Kicking it at the Comfort Inn, ready to go over to the Hooters pre-party. Let's make this happen. Come on. Kids are welcome. It's a sleep in, but whatever. <laughs> Matt, where y'all say? Oh, we got a nice hotel right down the road in that town. Uh, what's it called? Hyman. Hyman. Harm? Hyman? Harm. I think it's called a... No, Harm. Hiram? Harm. Maybe it is Hiram. Harm. Hyman? Harm. Hyman. Harm. Hiram. Harm. You know, you might be right. Harm. Hyman. Okay. <laughs> Walmart sunglasses. Hit the cage. Glasses didn't break, but cut my head wide open. It's all right. Truck's going wild. You rock. 2012, baby. Woo! Ooh. Oh, good. <laughs> God. <laughs> God. <laughs> what flavor is this? Blueberry. Blueberry? Yeah. I haven't had blueberry shine. I think I'm out of air. Oh. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> and burn it off. Yeah. You know what I mean? It'll, 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 it'll grow hair and burn it. It's all good in Dallas, Georgia, baby. Oh, yeah. That Woo! one's good. This one, not not so much on this one down here. I need some. A little help. A little help. Man, we were on the hill trying to slide it sideways, and sure enough, it was just tagged the caterpillar. Yeah. That's a nice, though. It's nice. It's a clean, it's a clean cut. It's good. Absolutely. Hopefully it won't cost too much. Yeah, Cameron, you got this fixed, right? You can handle this. Yes, sir. All right. Knock it back out. Very good. Cameron, don't spill my Bud Light. All right. All right. Last night we got f***ed up as usual. Same thing as the night. You're but we get f***ed. Are you ever coming back to this place? Oh, we coming back every time, baby. Every time. Oh, Super Rebel. Very nice. Super Rebel just patted me on the ass, just for those of you following along at home. Just saying. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> That's all good. <laughs> <laughs> Super Rebel gave me a little, gave me a little shot there. Welcome to the first ever Trucks Gone Wild Flex Off. <laughs> Ah! 
We were worried about you, yeah. sir, and you you did beat it, beat and you you it. whooped its ass is what oh, yeah. you did. Oh, yes, You're I You're like did. the champion. We're going to celebrate? Oh, yeah. Thanks, dude. You're all right. See that, Crystal? They just walk around and hand me beer. I know. They even open it for me. If, I, if my hands are full, they've been known to. You are a true Southern gentleman and a champion. Cheers. Hey, we're here with Scotty Hartsog. Hey, we're here with Scott Hartsock, um, driver. <laughs> driver of. Hey, we're here with Scott Hartsock, driver of Gunslinger Mud Truck. But it's not a mud truck. <laughs> this is Katie G. Janine. She's, she's my new co-host. Wait, what? <laughs> this is what? Wait, what? Tana Shoshi, boy. Woo! Woo! Let's go. This is my girl right here. Christine and uh. We're at the bar, we're having fun, we're drinking beer, we're doing everything we but want. But we're not at the bar, we're at Puddin' Creek Mudbog. Puddin' Creek Mudbog, we're getting drunk. <laughs> it's the sex girl I met my life. I'm gonna ask her to marry me. Girl, will you okay. please marry me? Oh, we didn't get married at Puddin' Creek. Nobody deserves it more than Jimmy Riggin. You've been trying for a long time, and you, my friend, are the freestyle champion out here today. Congratulations, brother, you are the man. Okay. <laughs> so, Willie, tell me, what exactly popped you this? Going balls out for Trucks Gone Wild. Hey, you happen to get one of these? Hey, what are you doing? I'm going to get one of those. Oh, man, it costs a lot more money than that to get one of these. BigShocks.com. <laughs> Matt, don't bring this to the table. I got it all under control up here. What's up, guys? Yeah, baby, what's up? Dallas, Georgia in the house. No, I don't. What? Matt, what? what's going on? This is not OK. I work out. What? All right, so so why the name Team Toilet? Uh, everything we touch turns to including our rental camper. I'm in the pits here with Jimmy Dyer. So how'd that run go? Well, I think it went pretty good. Actually, I would say it was amazing. I think amazing. it really was. I think pretty I was amazing. amazing. I, think, you know. I think it was pretty amazing. You gonna, you gonna go again? Yeah, I'm, I'm going three times. That's how I do it. They gonna let you go? If they don't, I'm gonna start running <laughs> over. Just Tim, dude, looking good, man. You've been working out or what? Oh, man, I, I, I've been trying to bulk up a little bit, but I, I really got something to show you, man. Oh, yeah. Here, hold these for me, please. All right, brother. I got them. I got them. All right. What's going on? We're out in the middle of the country, having a good time. This is what America is all about, man. I'm feeling patriotic. Holy crap. Who in the world are you? America, man. You're America, yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hot America, girl. What's happening? 
Oh, Jesus. Remember you? <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the lead singer of White Lion, Mr. Mike Tramp. Woo! Mike, dude, yeah, man. Big Red, it's been about a year or so since we've seen you, man. Anything new? I'm still big and I'm still red. We're going wild! Chuck D, I've been thinking, man, out here on the reservation, we gotta have some Indian names, right? You got one for me or what? Uh, I have several. Oh, let me hear them. Full mouth. I don't know, it's not so keen on that. No. White mouth. Oh, no, definitely not so cool on that. I gotta look for you. How about Chucky e. D rinks a lot? Or Chucky e. D runk a lot? Or cirrhosis? Cirrhosis, I like. Cirrhosis. Yes. Or likes young boys. How about that? That sums it all up. Not legal. <laughs> what is the legal age at the reservation for young females? Whoa, whoa. 14. Look. <laughs> yes. I saw our head TGW historian. He cannot be wrong. I just, I want to comply with the laws here, the local laws, so I want to be sure. I'm standing here saying hi to the legend right now. The legend. The man. The, the whole king. Dude. Listen, if you're handing that out, I will take it. But right, you'll never you hear me say it. that. You better, you better never be hear me say that. that face. <laughs> it's smiling. Right, My hat yeah. just got tighter, too. Thanks, all right, bro. Hey, boy. <laughs> I love it up here, but the deal is nobody can really hang with me. This is bad steel. Whoa! Oh. He talks way too damn much. <laughs> oh, my God. You okay, bro? We're good. Right, cool. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> all right. <laughs> that was perfect. That was perfect. Thank mm -hmm. you.